Welcome back, Crafty Queen Bee here, ready to show you how easy you can make this cute party tray. Friends, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Today I'm going to start with the items that you're going to need to put this pretty little tray together. Very inexpensive and easy to make. What you're going to need are two clear plates and I got these from the Dollar Tree. A small plate, a little serving plate. Two candle holders. And uh, I guess this is a votive uh, candle holder. And of course, our friend E6000. Well, let's not waste any time and let's get started. The first thing that I'm going to do. This one had a clear uh, cereal bowl as a base, uh, but I had to use something different. I thought I had an extra one and I didn't, but I uh, made this work. Okay, I'm going to turn this over and I'm going to uh, get my E6000 ready. And just put some along the base. Okay, the tricky part is trying to center the plate <laughs> right on the top here. I think this looks about right. Okay, the next thing I'm going to, going to do is I'm going to take the candle holder and I'm going to turn it upside down and glue it upside down. That way you have more room to put either veggies or your cupcakes or your cookies on your tray. So let me put some E6000 on it. And friends, E6000 takes a little while to dry. If you want it to dry really good, let it dry overnight. That looks about right. Then you repeat with the big plate. I just love having pretty dishes at my parties and get togethers. Of course, we haven't had any in a while, but I'll be ready whenever we do. Okay, center your next plate on top. Again, E6000 on your candle holder. Okay. Looks about right. And once again on the top with your smaller plate. All righty, here we go. Okay, friends, there you have it. You let it dry overnight 
and you have this pretty tray the next day. You, like I said, you can use it for your veggies, you can use it for your cookies, you can use it for your cupcakes, or as in my case, I'm using it for my fake cupcakes. And I'm displaying this new item that I'll be sharing with you, and it's my candy apple. Whoops! My candy apple that I'll be sharing with you on how I made that. Um, friends, another thing that I found this useful for, um, I have a lot of jewelry and I just like to take off my earrings and just throw them on my little dresser. So I'm making one of these to hold my jewelry and I'm putting it in my dresser in the closet. And uh, for the one that I'm making for my jewelry, which is going to be this one, I think, uh, I'm going to add some little bling. And this is the bling ribbon from the Dollar Tree. Look at that, friends. Is that not cute? I'll add it to the top, and then I'll add it to the bottom, and then I'll use it as my jewelry tray. Okay, friends, there you have it. This was short and sweet. Join me next time where I'll be decorating a Valentine wreath. Until then, see you next video. Bye.